you just had to interrupt one of those painful tasks. Oh, okay, I saw a dead body near the dead body. I saw you running away from the dead body. I just came in. I just you came in. You liar. Pro had so quad. many opportunities to kill Pro me. Boom. Holy freaking farts. <laughs> uh, 9.996. How badly. Go, 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 yes! Come on. Go. God damn it, I'm trying to avoid a red cell. <laughs> 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 was it the red shell I threw backwards that hit you? No, I got hit with three red shells. That was so epic. Slash. <laughs> 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 Is is a lot more intense. <laughs> oh my God! He nodded at me. Did you see that? <laughs> I did not. <sighs> Shit. Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 fuck, 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 fuck. <sighs> oh. Oh my god, that was so lucky. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god, that has never happened before. That's a fucking clip if I've seen one. Which we all know isn't gonna happen. Right. Go! Run Get up! Just go! Go! Just go! Go! Just go! Go! No! Why did I do that again? Oh my god! Why did you do that? Ooh! The audio's breaking while the stream loads in. What's going on, everybody? A little twitch, so I can see what y'all are freaking saying. Behave yourself, Twitch. Oh, I see what happened. It didn't change my title name because I had the word freaking hillbillies in it. Twitch is so sensitive. Apparently hillbillies is such an insult now. Yeah. <laughs> How's it going, guys? All right. So I did hardwire the laptop in, so we should have minimal audio problems today, hopefully. Not going to say they're not going to exist because they're going to exist still, but at least it hopefully shouldn't be as bad as it was the last time we played. I don't know exactly if you guys remember where we were. Um, we were just getting ready to start um, Chapter 3. So... Go ahead and run our shout outs real quick and then we'll pick up where we were and then drink open take a quick hit damn that was a nice shot 
That wasn't my if shot. If somebody could clip that, I would be appre I'd appreciate that. People might die in chapter three unless we are smart. Look at that beard. It's glorious beard. There you that are. That beard was better. Give me a second. That lack of beard is shameful. You think you're yourself a beard, OG. Join the ranks. Okay. I pulled a room, what you suggested. I'm really dying. I said that OG needs to grow a beard. You got a beautiful beard. I got a beautiful yep. beard. OG's got a baby face. You took a nap earlier. Go figure on the day that we're not uh that we're not playing DVD, right? Okay, so shout outs are given. We're all caught up. I got my drink. Didn't take my hit yet, but we'll get there in a second. <laughs> Let's go! All right, let's go see what this stupid skank's got to say. I needed to grow. No, not you, not you. <laughs> I was talking to. I was talking about right, you OG. Want me to dab? Here you go. Oh well, we got Kenny in here too. Uh -oh, What's up, Kenny? Dabbing, guys, watch out. <laughs> no, I did not say that at all. Dark. <laughs> I promise. All right. Chapter three, baby, let's go. It's going good, Kenny. We're just getting, just starting now. Chapter three. The quarry. Stupid game. What are we in middle school? Why should I even care? Anybody can kiss anybody. Stupid. Stupid. Great. Where the hell am I? Walking off in the woods in the dark. That's smart. Hold on, Abby. We'll walk in a second. Can I watch the TV? Dad, yes, but don't turn it on. That'd be something smart assy my old man would have said. Alright. What was the point of that, like, mini cutscene? Here, you lose control for, like, 0.5 seconds. Yeah, we could do control. Thought I heard something. Spoopy, it's coming. I don't know, spoopy lady is spoopy. We shouldn't be going this way. This isn't our first time controlling Abby either, Royal. God, this is such a walking simulator. Oh, we got another card. Nice. Now the old lady will give us another hint. Oh, something in the tree. Yo, what's up, Panda? How you doing, girl? There's a shout out coming your way right now. Hold on one second. And if you don't give this girl a follow, Panda Depress, she is the coolest girl ever. Does play freaking horror games when she streams. DVD. Didn't even scare me. It'll make you scream. <laughs> Jesus. I looked down at the wrong time. <laughs> if it'll scare you, she plays it. As the last game she's playing is The Sims. Don't listen to that. <laughs> Nah. -uh. We call back. Oh fuck! Go, 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 Hold on. Go 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 go. go. Nah. -uh. 
You feel like streaming Phasma? Oh. <laughs> you won't. Oh, okay. So we can either call back or say nothing. I think. I think. Let's call back. Nick! Fuck it. Abby. You won't do it. Again. I'm over here. Coming. Coming. Nick. Up one percent of fast streamers at one point. Jeez. Hey. Um. Nick's alive, so we know that much. Oh, Jesus. Have you played this game uh, before, Panda? Doing all right. A little sniffly. Got some allergies going on. Everybody else in the house has it, too. But doing all right. Challenging you? Now you play what you want to play, buddy. But I don't think you'll do it. Let's beat Honest. Abby's our good girl. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. For not to make quick decisions. That's what the pause button's for. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. Hmm. Let's be direct. Guess Emma's had a thing for you all along, huh? What? No, no, no way. She was just trying to make Jacob jealous. I was just... Playing along. You seem to enjoy playing along. I enjoyed helping Emma make Jacob jealous. That's about it. Do we kiss? 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 Do we kiss him? Hmm? Do we? What do you guys think? Yes? No? What? Keith. Just shut up and Keith. After what? Finish that sentence. That was like three days ago. We don't remember that. <laughs> Streaming hobby will have to come to a stop when you move out of the mother's house and your father's. That's going to suck. No more baby surgery today. Hell yeah. Kick it to the curb. Kith. All right, let's kith. Let's kith. Shut up and kith. God, butterfly effect. This is where the hillbilly is going to get us. Uh oh. Did you hear that? Mm hmm. Should we look? Oh boy, what's it going to be this time? We have a motherfucking bear watch. Quit your job, so you got to start streaming. Oh shit. Whatever it was, ran the fuck away. Scary monster. It's the boogeyman. Something sinister to kill the mood. It must have been a toddler. Growls and everything fit perfect. Give me juice. I demand cookies. <laughs> Too growly. Is that a bear? It's too fast. I know we're gonna have to be fucking quick here in a second. Run! Jesus, what the fuck was that? He just left her ass behind. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. GG next, Nick. Oof. Ah, ah, ah. Run or help, run or help, run or help, run or help, run or help. Fuck. Be smart and run. We gotta save Abby, right? But if we do that, we gotta help him, right? We can't let Nick die. Ah. Uh, uh. He is still just sitting up there waiting for us. Oh, we're so fucking dead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, hold on.
Speaking of kids having a freak out, <laughs> my oldest came out and uh, it is an interactable film. Freaking out about our TV. Bought a DVD player for yesterday because we knew this one was going out. So that's probably all it needs. It's just flopped out. I might get called in there to do techie duties. I feel bad continuing without Lexi out here. She's like totally into this. We don't know. She got attacked. She got attacked. We don't know that she's dead. Everybody's going to die in this playthrough. Like, I can just smell it now. All right, hold on. I'm going to go help her real quick. Uh, setting this up. So I'll be right back. Trust me, I would too, except this thing's on constantly, and I'd rather have a cheap DVD player to throw at it. Anyways, I'll be right back. All right. See, and honestly, I mean, yeah, having the writable would be nice. I don't really need it, though. But uh, I want a Blu-ray player anyways because my stupid Xbox One's disk drive doesn't work anymore. Just fucking dumb. I hate that. <laughs> All right. Our objectives is to survive the attack. I'm just giving Lexi just one more second to come out here, so hold on. She's got her headphones on, but I want her to be able to watch, too. Fucking freaking out, man. Oh, I thought I was going to be a hillbilly. Fuck, is it a skinwalker? Ooh, that'd be fucking creepy. Oh, my God. It's the unknown. The quarry called it before DVD. I love how I mentioned that they haven't touched the Oreos in weeks, and then all of a sudden everybody wants nothing but Oreos. She probably would have been chased when she ran away. So that, yeah, that was my logic too. When Panda said to stay, like that was kind of my logic too. Like, okay, well, it's kind of like the whole pig thing when, with uh, uh, was it Abby and Nick also earlier when the pig attacked. So I feel like had we had ran, the pig probably would have gutted the shit out of Nick. And that would have just been the end of Nick right there. <laughs> but then we would have avoided all this nasty stuff. But I don't think they would have killed him off that early, right? I don't know. I guess we'll find out in our Everybody Dies playthrough. But hell, everybody could be dying tonight. Who knows? Let's find out. And it kind of is more of an interactable film, but I really enjoy these kinds of games, too. I like the decision-making and then just like knowing that the story can go completely different depending on your decisions. Like, going through and playing it a completely different way and having a totally different outcome is great. Okay, she's back. Ready, set, go. Gotta get Nick. Go get Nick. Minecraft story mode is better. <laughs> I have played... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. We, went through... we tripped. Run, hide, 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 run. We're running. Oh, fuck. You gotta mash that shit. The fucking werewolf? 
Oh man. Uh, uh, uh. Seems like a bad idea. Seems like a very bad idea. I feel like we're setting her up to die in this tree. Watch abs. Oh, it's climbing. Dying. Oh, we're dying. Oh, we're dead. Oh, we're dead. No, Abby. Ooh. This is all because I fucked up when running. Gotta be a motherfucker werewolf. Now we're hiding. Look, she's using the DVD corner technique. Literally holding our breath right now. Literally holding our breath right now. Don't let go. 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 He would have mauled her face in. Oh. People weren't lying when they said that it was going to pick up. It's a fun game. Again, we don't know if he's dead. We just left him mortally wounded. We don't know the outcome just yet. Yet. Maybe he turns into one of them. Now you can hardly stand it though. By now you know it's not going to stop. It's not going to stop until you wise up. No, it's not going to stop. He needs drama. No, it's not going Throwing to rocks. It's off the river monsters, man. How are we gonna treat this? We're we gonna be an asshole to him. Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you're done that. Of course. Let's attract the lake monsters. Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, it's just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... He caught the feelings on some summer loving, baby. You just love having an audience, huh? Oh, Jacob. I mean, you just, I can't believe you, like, you fucking Frenched him. You know, in front of everyone. Jesus. Well. No, but Nick is kind of. You know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> you you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sourpuss, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No. Nothing. Never mind. Oh, motherfuck. We're going to get caught with that piece in our pocket now, aren't we? She's going to call us out on it. You can stand here, sulking. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Summer fun, right? Apparently, oh, bounce you. Wah, wah. Is not quite cool. Okay. 
Yeah, we love these kinds of games. But yeah, that's what it is. It's pretty much like an interactable film. I mean, I still have to do things and find stuff. I can miss all the bonus objectives, not get any of the tarot cards, miss pieces of evidence, pieces of the story. I mean, I still have to interact with it, but... Shit. They're about to go skinny dipping in that. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? What are we gonna do? Fuck, what are we gonna do? Oh, we found another one! Hey, that's the first time we found two in one chapter. Nice. I mean, that was kind of obvious and give it to us, but still, nice. Monster. Not long ago. See, we're still missing. We missed one. I'm assuming that this is probably from the first one, though, the prologue that we missed. Wonder if it was near here. It was if we examine it again. Oh wow, this shit goes deep. I fucking read the whole newspaper article and everything. Shit. Okay, so we need to start like double examining our pieces of evidence then. I got a feeling. And sack it, huh? Oh well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Who the hell is Thackett? Who the hell is Thackett? He's just very Thack all the time. He's just hungry and he's a Thack. I want to play the Walking Dead ones too, the Walking Dead Telltales, because I know that we can also do like interactive stuff with that, like where chat decides what we do. Jesus Christ, if I was towels, where the hell would I be? Can we walk any faster? I mean, when did this become the default walking speed in general? Some binoculars. That might come in handy. All turtle running. Okay, where are we looking? Where are we looking? Gotta be something spooky we're supposed to see, right? That somebody's just gonna fucking jump scare us, isn't it? Over the ridge line. See. See nothing. It's actually kind of. We're missing something. I made a spooky noise when I saw that something over here. Fuck. Someone up there? Yeah, I'm gonna go with probably everything's fine. That's the second time now somebody's pointed out there's somebody in that lighthouse. Hmm. What are these numbers? They're dates. What? Okay, hold on. Okay, so boathouse logbook. And it's got the sailing rules. Oh, God damn it. There's no towels. Go figure. There's no towels. None? There's exactly. 
exactly zero. You never know, right? <laughs> Over here. Nothing we can look at. Why is it so dark all of a sudden? Okay, so we're gonna fucking see shit. <laughs> Give me your shirt. Sweater. I mean, yeah, right? Sweater. He's wearing two shirts. He's literally wearing two shirts. Okay, well, I guess we could just like drip dry or I mean, you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really know how to talk to a girl. Smooth. <laughs> Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. <gasps> oh, but I can because you see, oh, help, help, I'm, I'm drowning and I. I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save right, me. Right, so cringe. I know that's the point. It's just like, I'm like, where did his shirt go? Like, all of a sudden, you just like snapped it off. Just like, it's gone. They had to snap that shirt. It's done. <laughs> just like, I swear, I was looking at her two seconds beforehand, fully clothed, and then bam, just like she's all the way in her bras and panties already. This is so 90s slasher cringe. I love it. Like, I literally love it. It's so campy. It's an A-plus from me. Yeah, well, no, we're fucking cannonballing. You got, no, we're, we're goddamn cannonballing this shit. I already know. Okay. What's this? A female in need? Fear not, fragile thing, for Hurricane Jake is here. Cannonball! Oh, oh, oh. Cold, cold, cold. Oh, Hurricane Jake. <laughs> Hurricane Jake. <laughs> yeah, Hurricane Jake is here. Every time one of us plays Jake now, that's what who it has to be. Hurricane Jake. <laughs> Hurricane Jake Park. Flash, yeah. yeah. Attack! <laughs> he has to run sprint burst. There's a body floating next to you. <laughs> Move. Like you didn't see it coming, right? Come on now. Hmm. So we flirt. Okay, hey. Look. <clears throat> Check this out. Uh, okay. She doesn't want us to be sentimental. Take a we gotta make her fall for us. Uh, yeah, for your like, um little subscribers or whatever top 10 guys who will keep you satisfied at summer camp hell no oh, so i get nine more what we failed at life but it was great <laughs> oh i thought she would have liked that boo on us Shit. Oh fuck. Fuck oh fuck oh fuck. I mean obviously we're gonna help Abby, right? But if we help Abby, we're gonna lose that rotor arm. If we lose that rotor arm, we're not getting the fuck out of here. I hate these decisions. Emma! Jacob! Over 
over here. Did you hear that? What? Uh, it was like a, like a scream. And it, it sounded like Abby, but like not the good kind of scream. I can't hear you. Okay, look, just, just hold on. I'm gonna go check it out. What? Seriously? Why didn't he bring her with her? Like, bitch, get over here. We need to go. What? 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 That is the worst. Oh my god. What are you doing? Oh my god, we doomed her. She gonna die. She gonna die so hard. Right? Right? And these three are still at the fucking camp. That was some mighty fine social disruption there, Caitlin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? <laughs> You're an evil genius. Who do you think is going to make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know. Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Oof, hey, that kind of hits a little deeper now. Preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> <laughs> so, you noticed that too, huh? So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Yeah? Just the three of us? Alright, Dylan. Truth or... Uh, I sound like Abby. Oh my gosh. Uh, we gotta help her. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? This way. Come on. The gun. Come on, let's go. Did she grab the fucking gun at least? Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Uh, uh, um, um, worried, worried, right? Yeah, worried. That's right. That's what I do. Yeah, like two seconds. Hurry. Where's Nick? I... Come on, breathe, girl. Go, Get it out. Nick, go. Okay, I got this. Cool. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. You know, we probably should have sent her. Now that I'm thinking about it, she's kind of a badass with a gun. We kind of, oh, well, fuck. Right. We're making a lot of oh, fuck decisions tonight. At least the bat pack survived. The bat pack lives another day. Okay, short cutter path. I'm thinking we should go. Oh man, I don't even know. I'm thinking shortcut path. Oof. All right, Royal, you're the tiebreaker. Huh? Eh. Did you guys suck. Oof, story. Whatever. I'm getting people killed anyways. <laughs> I guess I'll just continue to follow the path then. Shortcuts could be traps. Yeah, well, this bridge is probably going to break. We probably should take a nice shortcut. Shortcut looks pretty good right about now, huh? Broke our damn ankle. A trip in the day, fool. No butterfly effect on these ankles. Man, they want to keep you on your toes now with these QTEs. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Royal might be right. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, oh, don't shout. Don't shout. Don't shout. I shouted. I shouted. Get the fuck off of him. Stop. Stop. I'll shoot. 
There ain't no way. Oh, oh man. Okay, Nick didn't die. Nick didn't die, and we were able to save him. So, for now. No, I'm telling you, that shotgun shot should have probably done a little bit more than just drop him to his knee, but I'll take that, I guess. Didn't even grab his clothes. Didn't even grab his clothes. Like, this dude making some stupid ass fucking choices tonight. There's a half naked girl waiting for you back there, Jacob. What are you doing? Okay. They already have them rescued, which means we are quite literally walking into a trap. Oh man, Jacob's gonna die. That's the pig. I think that was the pig dying. I am not calling out. I literally did not press A at all. Oh no, Jacob. We put him right into a horror movie death scene. That's so on us. Come on. Oh man, should we, uh, should we beg him to let us go? Should we threaten him? Should we be all ballsy and mansy about it? Oh, please, please, man, just, just let me down, okay? Just, don't hurt me, please. Oh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? Uh, 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 Oof. Son of a bitch. Oh, what are you doing? Shh. Quiet. I feel like this is a life-making decision right here. It's throw dirt. He's, because I don't know if you noticed, but he's like reaching for me right now. Like he told me to be quiet. My option was to throw dirt into his face. He cut me down. Maybe he's a friendly killer. I'm afraid if I throw dirt and piss this guy off, though, he's going to rip my shorts off and make me eat my testicles. Yes. If you hunt or not a killer, well, then he just took a hell of a buck shot to the shoulder. <laughs> he must have been hunting with Dick Cheney. <laughs> to 
<laughs> and the dirt would get in his eyes, and he'd have to make the Myers noise. Be, we could freaking run. I think there's the logic there. But I somehow feel like if we throw... <laughs> I feel like, okay, hear me out. If we throw dirt at him, what's going to happen is Jacob's going to fucking run, and then Billy Boy over here is going to grab the rope and pull us back. Like, I feel like that is going to be what happens. But if we don't do anything, I don't know what's going to happen. So you know what? I'm taking the dice on Jacob's life. Not you guys. Helps if you close your eyes. Oh, oh. What are you doing? Shh. Stop. Help. Help. Tastes bad, don't it? It's for your own good. Where are you off to now, girly? What the fuck? Huh? What the fuck? Yeah, that's Randy. Well, that would explain the pig noises. Okay, right, hold on. Hold on. We will wait for you. Oh, we're going to see our old lady friend again. The chapter's over. Wait for you, OG, to come back from ad break. Oh, shit. Hey, hey. No one is squeezing anybody. I'll be right back. Ah, it went right here. You subscribed. You get a fortune cookie now. Partially because I'm stoned and hungry and want a fortune cookie, and also because I love these things are fucking hilarious. Especially when you get the cheap ones. Oh, you're gonna love this. Your eyes are the windows of your soul. Don't worry, be happy. And your Chinese word, because we get to learn Chinese. Review. Win. See. Or spit cookie. That works too. There you go. Thanks for the sub, man. Enjoy no ads. It was, it was, no, I bet you anything it was blood. But it's going to be like he's marking us so that we don't die. Like he's helping us survive. Watch. That's probably what it's going to be. That's my theory right now. I bet you right now, as it stands, Jacob's the only one who's not going to die. Bob Marley fortune cookies. I know I got a kick out of that one. Yes, he was. There was the old dude in him. It was him. He was one of the hillbillies. He's the one who was banging the, the hunting sign in, in in the beginning. When they were <laughs> setting up the camp. And yeah, those fortune cookies are actually pretty good. That's my point. Maybe they're hunting. Maybe they're hunting the creature that attacked Nick. Maybe that's what it is. That's my theory right now. That's my going. I have zero knowledge of this game. Going in blind. What I'm given, this is what I'm thinking. Those billies are the freaking hunters going after this monster creature that attacked Nick. Seems like just a blink and you're back to see me again. So, then... What have we got? And really, thanks for the sub. I appreciate it, uh, OG. It's the star. Stars. Stars in the night. Sky. 
beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance. Fear of despair, trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity. You did warn me, that's true. The tower. Jump free of your troubles. Fight or flight? That's the question we all ask ourselves, but often when leaping out of danger, we're still faced with certain peril. Watch your step. It could be your last. That worries me about Jacob. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? Yes. Good. Great chat. Pay attention. But I can only delve deeper into one possible future. So which is it? Choose. No. Oh. Okay, so we only get one future we can delve into. I'm really kind of worried about her tower one, though. I want to kind of... I think I should follow the tower line. Because I'm really thinking that that is... Exactly. I want to know what this danger... Like, who's going to misstep? Like, did we really just kill Jacob? Oh, that was what's her doobie. We can't let her use the zip line or she's gonna go. Back to Hackett Square you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. Man. Chapter four. It was, it, it was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast, and, and there was a, uh, there was a hundred. Can go off on the computer, too? Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Trying what? Oh, uh, can you draw what attacked you? Ooh, smart. I mean, that's kind of what I got from it. She took the zip line, and then it showed that she fell and died. <laughs> Okay, we got him back safely. Nick. Hey, buddy. Can you tell me what those guys did to you? Gosh, did. He's super out of it. Yeah. The, the, the hunter. Uh, yeah. There was a guy. There was something else. It's kind of animal. What? kind of animal. No, no, I only saw a dude trying to take him away. It's probably just disoriented, that's all. The dude was massive and angry. Is Abby? Hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Because teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. Full-size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I thought we don't get bears around here. Oh fuck! Look at that black stuff. That's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This uh -oh. is really bad, dude. What's this gonna fucking turn him into? Uh, so, sorry. Okay, it's okay. Oh, fuck that. We should amputate. Jesus Christ, bro. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. Bear wolf. What? Yeah, I kind of don't know how comfortable I am cutting this dude's leg off. <laughs> like at all. I mean, I, I kind of understand that he's not wrong. But 
That's a pretty heavy fucking decision to make, man. Ugh. You can turn the kid all you want, okay? I have to, okay, so you're you're by a fucking campfire. You got, like, scratched in your leg, and they're like, dude, we're going to hack your leg off now with a hacksaw. You think that he's just going to be running around like fucking Ash? You know, goddamn shirt on his nub, just happy about it? Uh-uh. That dude's going to die. We're in the middle of the fucking woods. I mean, we only we get a frustrated and we get dismissive. We get you're an idiot and why? I don't want to go with you're an idiot. Maybe we should just be dismissive at first. So let's see his thinking so we can dismiss him why properly. Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? You want to chop his fucking leg off, dumbass? I guess homie's gonna keep the gun from now on. Hey! You got a gun! And I know how to use it! Sort of. Real reassuring, buddy. Brian, what if it's Jacob or Emma? What if it's not? But be careful. We're kind of with Royal on this one. What the fuck am I doing? It was probably nothing. Yeah. But is it gone? Yeah, you better run. Get cocky. That's how we get yeah, jumped right. by freaking bear wolves. All right. So, uh, Lodge is sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? I do not want to shoot, I'm telling you. Don't shoot, don't shoot! I'm here to save you. Holy shit. Nick. Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. Oh, fuck, of course they are. we question what happened or should we ask where Emma is yeah, I'm kind of more curious about this so wait, what happened? Ooh, right, right. sorry okay, me and Lexi stop. were on question like I was saying okay I heard Abby screaming so I came running like as fast as I could from the lake yeah and then and then out of nowhere I stepped into this like I don't know, like a like a booby trap like some sort of hunters trap hunters I told you it was hunters the goddamn thing snared my leg hoisted me halfway into the tree just Zoop. So I'm hanging there, half naked, and then this guy with like a fucking machete comes right up to me, looks me right in the fucking eyes. Fucking machete. But I thought that guy okay. Was and booked it right the fuck out of there. We gotta get Nick and Abby back to the lodge, like right now. Uh, hard agree. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? Oh yeah, no. Um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with like um, he had like a bottle. Thing. I don't know, dude. It's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah. Oh, it's super fucked up. I gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me? Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Get. Somebody's gonna get shot. Somebody's gonna get shot. Somebody's gonna get shot. Somebody's gonna get shot. I'm just gonna wake up. Fuck. Yeah. No, fucking stop. We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks, both of you. Teenage Jinx, baby. 
Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Brian. Sorry. This is bullshit. Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. And what? Risk another run-in with Captain Deliverance? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zip line. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. Mm -hmm. We need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. Said the uh, magic words that I don't like this chapter. So yeah, I have an idea. It's a wheelbarrow. A riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool. Well, one thumb. One available thumb. Okay. And it was here, on this strange, uninhabited island, that this brave young. We're gonna put Nick, Nick in the wheelbarrow and carry him down the path. And it's a full moon. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm going to go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I want to go back because I don't. But even if I did, I can't. Because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. I'm not gonna see what the screaming was. Venting. Oh, explore venting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. We don't know. We could have also very easily killed one of the other five. I don't know. I think my slasher film ridden brain is like an unexcavated part of the quarry would have been like, nah, we ain't trusting that. Flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little. I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser. They're now. on the other beach. She's in the you island. That not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling, and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative by means of fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life i guess since this isn't live the choice is up to me <laughs> yeah exactly oh, what the hell we're in it now anyway well and truly in the thick of it because you know what else i was really excited for the next part of my life you know I mean, the summer was great, but what's next? I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory, and I know it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? <sighs> Abby sees me as this confident person, but really? I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different. All right, yeah, we know the tower is bad, so we're going to definitely stick down to the low road. And uh, that was a kind of no-brainer for me from the get-go. Maybe my horror brittle brain wouldn't have thought that through because I would have been like, she wants panoramic views, let's go up top. I round this damn corner and there's a fucking zip line in my eyesight. I am turning the hell around though. This is actually kind of fun. I 
I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. I kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the What if it's a ruse? This thing is going to jump us right here and then we're going to run up there. Oh, fuck. I'm by myself? I kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob. If you're watching, nothing personal. It's a me thing. We're cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. I'm kind of thinking aggressive. Maybe she really does want to think with Jacob. Because then she's going to go off on a little time. Maybe it's not. No, you know, maybe we're not cool. I did like you and blah, blah, blah. Give me an argument to, as to why reflective would be better. So, plus they kind of have a weird relationship anyways, because we keep fucking these things up with them. <laughs> you know what? Maybe, you know what? Yeah, I guess. Actually, no, we're not cool. You left me here on this freaky ass island. I'm so gonna make you pay for this. In fact, let's do this. Idea time. Okay, that was the not I was expecting, but I guess that I should have totally looked like fell for it. Should known. I'm sure Jacob knows how to tie his shoelaces. To be totally honest, laxatives in his drink. I think that's a felony. Oh man, I need some inspiration. I'd say throw your ideas down in the comments, but we'll all be long gone by the time this uploads. Maybe I should do a series of pranks though. No, no, those, those videos always seem so staged. God, whatever happened to good old fashioned authenticity? Say what you will about this game. At least it looks good. Oh fuck, there's a ladder. I don't want to go on it. Can I just walk past it? It's letting me go down here. <laughs> Ooh, invisible phone. Is there any purpose that for me to be able to come down here? Or was it just to be able to see butt? I'm confused. Okay, okay, camera, behave. I don't like this camera angle. Hate the Resident Evil style camera. Pick a fucking control stick. There would have been like a tarot card or somewhere down here. Oh man. Uh oh. It's forcing us to go up this ladder. <laughs> we don't like this. I guess I gotta do this one handed, huh? I mean, no, you can just turn your camera off and... That didn't sound great. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> so Ooh, I almost missed it because I was looking down. You know, 
I am nailing this ladder climbing. Yeah, but now I'm kind of worried if taking the ladder was a bad idea. All right. Butterfly effects and all. This is the luxurious Skyway Treehouse, obviously. Constructed in the year 180 fuck by a blindfolded man who used only the finest rotting wood, rusty nails, and donkey spit that money could buy. A real Hackett vintage classic. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well, now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there. And now look, it seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. Yeah, we heard I guess that. one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belonging? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Well, <laughs> Snoop, what would you do, Royal? Trap door seems like death. I mean, regardless, whatever's behind it will probably come through, anyways. Maybe it's just a raccoon. They're just ninjas. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. Bear mace. Hopefully. Nice. And we got a fucking taser. Fun. Okay, so I think there's something up there, and it is huh? not gonna make me jump. I can probably. Oh, she put it in her pocket. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore. Fucking Jesus. <laughs> It's the unknown. Are we spraying or are we tasing? Go <laughs> tase that motherfucker. Tasing that motherfucker. What eyes? Okay, it does have eyes. I was worried it didn't. Take the photo. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We're out of weapons now. Do we block the door or do we take the trap door? Oh, that's a tough decision. 
block first. I don't know. I feel like it's just going to come up and come through the door. I mean, I already did once. <laughs> Fuck it. God, it's chosen. Ah, fuck. Oh, run, bitch. Run, bitch, run. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just... I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. To answer your question, that's not the stream. Oh, that's man, lagging. It's, it's the game. I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? I don't hungry. Yuck, I hate granola. For long pig. Oh, I have to hold it down in order to claim it. Okay. We found a turret. It's not my fault. This will open the nurse. Claim the station. Xbox. There should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. You and I are going to find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yep. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Do you think that whatever attacked them out there is... I don't know. Has their yeah, I know, right? Something. What? I don't know, like, what if it got a taste for blood and now it's going to track them down? I, I doubt it. I just feel like if we stick with them, we're sitting ducks. I don't know. I really don't think that whatever attacked them out in the woods is going to get into the lodge. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're probably right. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. Look how everybody just left Emma out there and nobody gives a shit. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Yeah. Where are you going? I, 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 I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. I'm gonna be paranoid. He's gonna be our paranoid one. No, it's true. Caitlin said. So all I'm saying is that we are not professionals, okay? We don't know. We He could have rabies or something. Way to be optimistic, man. I'm just being realistic. We gotta call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? I don't know. Who says 911? Yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police? Ambulance? Huh. I mean, I don't write both. Like, do we have to be specific? Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance, or can you just say, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, help, help. My friends may have been attacked by bears, but 
maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And then one of them was kidnapped by these hunter guys with blood on their faces, and there may have been shots fired, but not by us, but also maybe by us. And they cut my friend Jacob down from a tree. Separate incident. Long story. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. Okay. Yeah, I saw that one coming. Dead. Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though? It's suspicious. Did you try the hang up thingy? What? Here. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Well, you know. You're right. You're in an you know? interactive Maybe that's just video what game. Think, man. Okay, so this phone's a no go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let, let, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay, just careful with it. I'll be fine. Okay. Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. The clear weather, what buddy? Weather, Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaked. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Do you think she really needs it, though? Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like, 20 seconds ago. Okay, sure, but... That's because I really wanted the gun. Just give her the gun, man. This kid's such a boner for these guns. Like, seriously. Uh, all right. You're right. Hey, we'll keep every mind. group armed. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. I hear that. Mm -hmm. Am I interrupted something? Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Well, maybe these two are going to start go bumping uglies.
No. No, sweetheart. No. No, 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 no. No, no. No, no. Oh, man. Fuck. Gonna eat her right off of it, watch. Nice and slow. Uh. No, Emma. to us. There was a reasoning behind my nice and slow. Okay. I thought, because when we were watching the, when we were watching the flashes, she was reeling it in super fast. And then she died. So I'm thinking that when she reeled it in, she fucked up the thing somehow. And so... Plus, I didn't want to alert the dude. So, Emma lives. And we completed another chapter. To see you. Good to see you. <sighs> A time again, is it? Strength. Hmm. Halfway there. Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power. Tapping into a, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces at work within us all, and with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. As always, there's more to see, and as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Show me what you've got. Who the fuck was that? So it's goodbye again. Who the fuck was that? I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Oof. That looked like the hillbilly. Who is he arguing with? Right, way there. Chapter 5. White noise. Have been, yeah. I, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. But it kind of looked like Nick was there. I left my bag. I, I brought you this. That was. Fuck. I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? How are you holding up? I'm... Uh, well, I, I, I'm just happy. You're okay. Are you okay? 
I'm sorry. I, um, I just asked there's, you that. Okay, the, I was looking, and the main story takes like 10 hours to complete. And if you want to see all the endings, it's like a 33 hour completion time. So I assume there's probably three different ending, like main endings with maybe a bunch of different like sub endings that can happen depending on your actions. Just in case. Oh, what happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Plus, I mean, you can kill off probably everybody and leave just certain people alive in like a bunch of different orders. I'm sure that changes endings a lot too. Uh oh. Did anybody else hear that? Shh. Probably just Emma, Sit right? Down and Ryan already left. Stay here. I'll check it out. We'll be fine. Just be careful. Stay alert. Let's try not to shoot Emma in the face, huh? Did we give her a broken ass fucking shotgun? He's gonna Santa Claus us, ain't it? Sneak down the fucking chimney. Oh, fuck. Just your friendly neighborhood, Hillbilly. Came to put the rabies, the rabies sauce on our face. No sign of them. When you find them, run them. And keep me posted, Bobby. Yeah, I think so. No, not Jacob, Nick. I fucking hit that. I hit that quick time event and he still took my gun. Hey, so this may not be like the best time per se, but like. What? Yes, yeah, so like I was just 
you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and the start of camp. Or to keep my balance instead of just like, hand yoinking it away and then be falling down and probably breaking you know, my neck. Like the last time we're going to see each other, you know? Sorry, Nick, what, what are you saying? Hey, don't worry about Caitlin, she's tough. I know. I'm sorry, Nick, I'm just distracted. Let's just get through the night, okay? Was I confident? Oh, hell the fuck, man. I'm just trying to make Nick the good guy so that when he dies, we all feel the feeling. It kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Duh, are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean... Of course I wanted it to happen. I just... That's not the option we picked. I didn't know if you did too. That... Seems like such a long time ago now. OG would have had everybody killed before the campfire scene. Uh, um, I, you can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. Just because he would get bored with it. Just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. Why is he being a dick? Uh oh. He's turning. What is going on out there, Caitlin? We have died. We have died. He's fucking turning. That's why his attitude's changing. Oh, man. Oh, my God. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. He's gonna give us a choice. Hide or run. Which one do we do? Oh, God. You can even see it in his eyes. You see his eyes? They've gone darker. Not a very good place to hide. Okay, well, what more do you expect? Nick's got a fucked up leg. <laughs> you expect us to jump out of a window? Kiss my screen. There you go, baby. Be happy. That's what he's looking like, right? Like, mwah. look at my sexy eyes. Just, oh, I'm too sexy for this hair. Oh. All right. Anyways, back to seriousness. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, Jesus Christ! Should have hid. Should have hid. Abby, no. Jesus Christ! He's got like fucking Wesker strength. Uh oh. Shit. Oh yeah, yeah, it used to be more of a actual radio station actually. Um, uh, you know, I mean, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. It's weird actually that there used to be kids with their radio and their portable CD player and everything and, you know, So we're dealing with werewolves. Everything we need is on the phone. Pretty much. Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Technology, it giveth and it taketh. So is is that something like that you want to go into? Camp radio? No, like uh, DJ or music or something. Oh, um, yeah. I mean, I like music, but I think I want to major in um, quantum physics. Wait, what? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, we're gonna. We're probably science, gonna run into Emma. Science guy. So let's try and be oh, smart yeah. about I mean, pulling you know, our guns out around here. here. Um, 
You BRB. No, I'm not gonna get Emma killed. We're trying to keep as many people I'm alive as humanly kidding. possible. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at Wanna see if we can survive a horror movie. I do that at home, and then here I um You're a wise wise cracking smartass. <laughs> Uh, that's a little harsh, but... Uh... No? Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé villain. Uh... And do, do you enjoy the blasé villain? <laughs> Not yeah, like you know, whatever, man. It's pretty cool. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm. Let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. Yeah, I like him. He's that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, here we are having this heart to heart that we could have had inside a building with a closed door. Oh, hey, wait. We were here earlier. I wonder if that audio thing is still here. Kind of an odd sign to have. And why is Boston the only one that doesn't have a distance on it? I remember that there was a tape recorder that we had put back over here when we were Abby, right? Oh man, it's dark as fuck. I wish we had a flashlight. Hey! Oh man. I told the kids to look after this. It's three times older than they are. Hell no. <laughs> Whoa, no, that was dumb. Why the hell did I do that? He's gonna attack us. Maybe Nick's gonna turn into like a good werewolf. Good. It wasn't even sitting there. All good? Probably should have checked around for more signs of stuff, considering all the random ass scratch marks that we're seeing on that building, but you know. We were. Oh, this place is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay, okay. okay. Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's, Mr. H wanted more storage, so that's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever. So, I think the range is about a mile. That's not a lot. How do you even know all this stuff? 
Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the ropes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's gonna be your a PC bit of a power up. Um, but that's where this comes in. I'm not trying to let them venture off on their own. They're that's doing cool. this all on their fucking it's own supposed to be shit. A signal booster. It's kinda janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. It's like Jacob running out with his clothes. So we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two way radio. So um, you know, we can talk. <clears throat> Uh, but then the best we can do that's is a good question switch it over yeah, he went to, to go back and find and emma see if anyone broadcasts anything back which is unlikely but well it, i mean it is what it is i guess yeah so what should i say uh just like make it sound urgent okay Help. Hello, how's it going out there? This is, uh, uh, we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and there's been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are everywhere, and there's these hunters, too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good, and a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help, so please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and uh, we don't know what to do, so please uh, come help us, SOS, uh, this is a, an emergency, you. S save our <laughs> ship, come on down, please help us. Did I do good? Was that... It makes you feel any better, he's probably going to die. Yeah. Heard of bears. Heard of bears. Yeah, I've heard of bears. What? Oh my god. All right, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything yeah, back. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. Yeah, what an SOS okay, call. Yeah, sure. Shit, what do you see? What the fuck? Uh oh. I got a ping on the radio, but no response. I'm gonna head to the. Wait, did he? Did he say lodge? I don't know. Huh? Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Oh, shit, they have ears on the hillbillies. Holy shit! They're talking about us. Because we just told them on the fucking radio. Fuck. They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Hey, hey, Shit. Let's let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. Uh, Ryan? <laughs> Is it a bear? Do it. Fucking do it. I don't trust my shot on the roof. Just gonna make a hole and he's gonna come through it. What, that? what is that?
fuck? What? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick. They're coming oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um, what about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can um, tell them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh. Oh, fuck, no. Oh, shit. Uh, the... I, hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get in the... Oh, fuck, dude. They're gone. But again, you just told... Fucking monster, fuck. Shit. How's it gonna go for them? What now? I mean, I'm gonna assume it looks pretty damn humanoid. From here on out, we're just gonna refer to him as the unknown. Are we desperate or are we aggressive? Not everybody's fluent in French, OG. Thinking aggressive. No, wait. Desperate? Uh. He's more of our smart guy, right? Let's keep him desperate. Anything we can do. I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just an animal, right? I mean, maybe we can scare it off. Uh. Nah. Well, it, yeah, He's our smart thinker. Let him cook. Hearing, like, a dog, Let him cook. Maybe we, we can play like a like a really high pitched feedback loop and just blast it. And, and I mean, it would hurt like hell, but you know. That's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. Pretty damn good idea. Do it. Okay. Okay. Come on, Dylan. Let's do this. Um. Pop up. What? It's almost. Hey, Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah, right. There's something missing. I do. What's missing? Oh, crap. You're intermediate. <laughs> Hold the wire. Oh, Fix it. fuck. I'll cover you. Now, go quickly. Oh, shit. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. the worst decision in the world. I hope you're fucking aware of that, all of you. This is an interesting choice. We can either take it off with the chainsaw or the shotgun. So do we kill him or do we kill him? I mean, that's pretty much just our options at this point. Homeboy's dead. I'm going to let you guys cook. I'm going to go to drink.
You're going to lurk and play DVD. Okay. Shotgun would shoot it off immediately. I mean, okay, so here is my sound logic to the situation. Chainsaw is going to take it out the fastest. Until your DVD. All right. But we've also seen how it's spreading in Nick. Oh, man, I hate this decision. Are you sure? Yes, fucking do it. Fucking do it. Get the water, get the water. What? Saved a friend from infection. Okay. Get it. Plug it, plug it into the thing. Uh, keep pressure on. Uh. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the We blew the speaker. Uh, Fuck. Did the trick. Uh, yeah, I know, delay. right? I mean, we're not in a realistic scenario. We're in a we're in a horror movie. Oh, right. oh fuck my hand! Right, right. Okay. Oh. Just hold on. Why did you do that? You told me to. Oh, it was a bad idea. Is it safe? I don't know. That thing's gone, but we heard those hunter guys on the radio. What? Picked up their walkie signal. They knew we were here. Fuck, you get a message out? Hands infected, though. Sure That's the point. <sighs> Great. What the hell was going huh? on at... Oh my god! Tell them what happened! Oh, um, I'm okay. I, I, I mean, I'm not, um, but it's, it doesn't, doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy fucking shit. Uh. Did that thing do this? No. Well, sort of. It... Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who's there? Who was she? Who the fuck was that? Did you call her? <sighs> right, I was thinking the same thing. Oh my god, is that Laura? Ah oh, shit, Dylan, what is that? What the fuck? If I was fire, it would be the rainfall. If I were the stars, you'd be these city lights. And if I was a moon in the sky, oh baby, I want your cloud coming dark. Yeah. Oh, you're back. Looks like that's one less vermin in the world. 
Let's take a look once more. No cards means no reading. Simple as that. Keep looking, though. There are still cards to find somewhere out there. We are doing shitty in the evidence. We spend so much time looking toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets too. Worth remembering that. Past holds secrets too. So it's goodbye again. I'll be here. I'll wait for you. Emma! Jesus Christ. Jesus! Fuck! Oh, man. God, this thing sucks ass. Jacob! Emma, is that you? this. Now he wants to walk faster. It's like the fastest anybody has walked in this game. Well, that bodes ill. Fucking hell. The big ass fucking boot print. Camera? Hmm. Maybe there's something on here. Big ass memory card. Stuck it in his underpants, so at least we know he's got a clue on him. Feeling. <laughs> Had a feeling there was going to be a freaking card hidden back there. We lost somebody because Royal went and lurked. Oh, God, Emma! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, my God, no way. Am I glad to see you? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Oh. You left me back there, you asshole! God, Emma, come on. Oh, God. What the fuck is going on? Look, I don't know, okay? Some, like, 
bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Yeah, pictures. Who? When? Why? Sorry, I'm just... I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... What? It was like what, Emma? Like, out of a horror movie. Okay, um... Well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear trying to defend itself, you oh, know? Oh, don't be a dick. You, you know it wasn't a fucking bear. No, you're right. You're right. And now we have these fucking the, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a We need to make... Vehicle. We need to do like a... They oh, we lost the camera. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, well... We need to mine. do a... a mm, got quite the funky... Replay of this hair. game and make it like a drinking game. So every time uh, somebody okay. mentions it's fucking bears... Okay. We've we have to take a shot. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. Oh, shit. Okay, you know what? You're right. Okay? You're right. I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please not do this right now? Okay, seriously? I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something out here. Or things? Like plural? Wait, really? A bunch of different things that want to kill us. Shit. She fell. It's not my fault. Thing pushed me. She broke through the wood. Oh, Jesus. Oh fuck, he barely missed that bear trap. Oh fuck. He is surrounded by these fucking things. Don't step back anymore. Adrenaline. Uh, 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 look, you could. Uh, Oof. I haven't seen you in a while. No, that was the old guy. Oh my god, it's Emma. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Should we do something? What can we do? She's dead. I mean, with the body. That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. Oh, fuck. Daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. Oh shit. I thought that was freaking Emma. Damn. Oh man. Poor Kaylee. Nick. You smell so good. Oh. Oh god, oh god, oh god. You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. No. Nick, 
what do you? Uh oh. Taste you. Oh, fuck. Hey. Come here. Uh, Nick, what the hell? It's because he's changing. He's turning. Get off. He needs her blood. He wants her meat. Do we help him? Hey, hey, it's okay. I'm okay. I got you. I got you. What did I do? I... I don't know. Let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. Okay, so this thing doesn't like water. It's good to know. Just try to rest. How far are we in the night? Fuck, it's only 11.33. Just try to rest. I'm sorry. Moving so much. It's pretty clean from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding, but you need to see a doctor. There. Look, this is all I've got left from the nurse's station. Ooh, fun. You better hope uh, we find you some real help before they wear off. We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens for the police. Yeah. Dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? <sighs> Easy, man. The infection like some acid or something. I I've got a fine feeling the cops are not gonna want to believe any of this. I think that I'm telling you, I think that the it changes them. Like it's like some kind of wear or something. Phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. You okay over there, Abby? Look, why don't you look around and see if you can find anything to help make Nick more comfortable? Well, she's not a doctor, she's a camp counselor. You see fucking shit. I wonder where Caleb is. Um, yes. This place was so different, like, remember, years ago. Remember, uh, in the beginning, when they were talking to, like, he was talking to the camp counselor, Ryan was, and he mentioned his, the camp counselors, I assume, was that son and daughter, probably? They were brother and sister, yeah. We found the sister dead. No, Ryan didn't die. It was one of the Hackett sis one of the Hackett kids. Camp counselors kids. And then freaking oh no, Royal's getting an ad break. Hey. And then Nick tried to eat us. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. I think we were she able to cut the infection out of him though. Yeah, he was like uh he was like a fish out of water. Right. Uh, sure. You know, something was weird when I tried yes. to clean his wounds, too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, 
all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit or scratched or whatever. He just kept moving around like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Mm, rabies? He's not frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. It isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, yeah. But I think it's more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like... Like my cat in the bathtub. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Abby? Yeah? Can I ask you something? Get close to him. Don't get fucking close to him. I'm not enjoying how come how like we'll, we'll play calm. We'll play into the movie trope. Please just tell me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. Such a oh, such a, such what? Such a cop out answer. This dude turned into a real prick. Making them all fucking crazy. I'm sick, Abby. Why don't you care about me? The infection sick in his brain. I, 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 I'm so just... smart, are you? Poor stupid Abby. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. Yeah. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I... Oh fuck! Whoa. Whoa, Abby. Abby, everything okay? Holy shit! He's so gonna Edward your Bella bitch. <laughs> Fuck that, we're dropping this motherfucker. Should have cut his fucking leg off. See what happens when you don't appetite. Told you guys. Don't listen. So I'm going to call it safe to say we've lost Nick. The fuck is he doing? <sighs> Rip Nick. Good old big dick okay. Nick. So, if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, 
partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters. I would go... We got no insight from last chapter. To the lodge. Check around back here and see if there's going to be a tarot card. He just weskered her like right across the fucking room. Nuts. Of course, after what he did to Billy Boy, I'm not too surprised. Nick has become unknown. Ugh. <laughs> Playing stories again. I had no idea kids were getting freaked out about this stuff. We officially suck as counselors. Yeah, at least he hasn't killed Abby yet. <sighs> I feel like if I was a tarot card, I'd be back here somewhere. Hiding out of plain sight. Really hate the camera controls. I feel like I'm playing a clunky Resident Evil game. Huh? Resident Evil? I looked inside the tent. Uh oh. Gotta get out of here. Why didn't we bring a torch? Asking the real fucking questions. Let's grab some wood off that fire, baby. Let's go. Then we're going to use our phone flashlight, which is probably going to die on us soon. Why would we most need it? Because kids and cell phones now. Exactly. Huh. Well, should we take the stairs? Or should we go through the freaking... Little ravine? I don't know. The stairs kind of seem a little bit safer. If we had a walking speed that was faster than a fucking mouse fart... That path is where the fucking terror card was hidden. What have we here? What is it? What am I? What am I looking at? Stickers. Confused. Okay. That's what I pressed it and it zoomed in on the ground. That was what I see in the scissors. Lodge is right over here. That's a tree. That's another that's a log. I guess we're going this way. Where are we going? God, I hate this cam this camera. We pick a control scheme. Both directions fucking control it. Am I backtracking? No. I think I'm backtracking. Oh, we're still gonna get jumped. This place is a lot harder to navigate at night.
tripping today. Classic pick a path. Before Pop is doing fast, that's it. That was dumb. That was dumb. Oh. I don't know if he actually slashed her, but damn, he broke her leg. It's running pretty good for a broken leg, just saying. Caitlin! Ryan! Abby! Doesn't feel safe. Right? Doesn't feel safe. Yeah, you left the door wide the fuck open. Again, she's walking perfectly fine. Didn't that thing just snap her leg? Ryan? People don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. No. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so funny. Oh fuck, it's Laura. Don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you Laura Kearney, you're Laura Kearney? Yes. You were supposed to be working uh helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up. You and the guy was I'm waiting. Yes, Old man. man. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her inside. Okay, I'm gonna open the door, slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. Oh fuck, she's missing an eye. Already? 
Here we are again. Just you and me. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Justice. An eye for an eye. Not exactly in some cases, but cause and effect. Actions and consequences. There's a balance to everything, and we all play a part in making sure the scales aren't tipped. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible futures? See, but you weren't here for it. Laura's from the very beginning, from like the prologue. There was two counselors who were supposed to show up that never did. It was her and her boyfriend. And they got there the night beforehand, before anybody was like supposed to be there. And we're pretty sure the boyfriend Max is dead. We're probably going to find out here soon. And Laura was unsure. Like she was knocked out with something. And that was the last we saw of her. Like we assumed she's been dead this whole time. So I'm curious to see what happens here. However. However, the real question is, do we have time for one more chapter? Sorry, you're late. What chapter are we on? No, I think that was seven. That was somebody with a pistol. So then, top, top. One down, remember. Isn't that terribly exciting? I mean, I don't know. Maybe it is. We're trying to figure out. So, uh, I guess that was six. So this is seven. You come. So, uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Did it? Did it freeze? Boom shakalaka! Oh man, where's Royal? Royal would be interested to know that Laura's alive. But he has to die now, or else he's going to turn into one of them.
What have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just... Shut up! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> Name. Eat shit. When I say name, you give me your name. Do I make myself clear? You've got my license. Can't you read? I am an officer of the law. I need you to do as you're told and answer the goddamned questions. I don't now. care what you are. You can't hold us like this. This isn't legal. I want a lawyer. Stop! You need to shut your mouth and listen to me or there is going to be a problem. Do we have a problem? Yeah, Laura. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait, hack it? Like, Chris hack it? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option? is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? Please. You just stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is Max alive? Right? But they've killed one of them now. What? Oh shit. I know you hear me. That's Max. Fuck. Max. The end of this film okay? was kid getting startled awake from having a bad dream. Yeah. Right. I mean I'm I'm kind of all mixed up, but more or less intact, I think. Why is everybody wearing the same underwear? Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked, the next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff. Everywhere. I know. I'm gonna as soon as it like flashes out I mean, of this, I'm going happened? to like when it gives me another save, I'm gonna quit. I was just too curious. I couldn't sleep on that. Ah, no, that's not the one I wanted to Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting Apparently I took a screenshot. Best, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What do you used to try to get you to talk? The Pincher the blade? Yeah, it is. It's a flashback. Punch? No, it, because Laura, we ran into Laura, me? like in our, like Who's in the future, like, present. The sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max. What? 
Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill, that's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Uh, I feel like I'm sarcastic, he's just gonna move. Sorry, sir, we'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? <laughs> All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Well, this cop's just a dick. He's obviously on a power run. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Don't do it. Come on. Hey, hey. Don't do it, Max. Let's get the fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. Hey! Stop struggling! Hey! Leave him alone! Yeah, leave me alone, asshole. Both of you shut up! Fuck you! I said shut up! Hey! Hey, you can't treat us like this! You're hurting him! Hey! Goddamn good graphics for a video game, just saying. Think, Laura, think. There's gotta be something in here you can use. Alright, I'm sure as soon as we find what we can use to get out of here, it's gonna give us a safe. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Yeah, I'm sure that'll work. Look at that. Somebody conveniently left a lockpick here. Spoon. Ew. Spoon? Good enough idea for Mike Wazowski to want to, you know, get Boo out of the city. Why can't it be good enough to get out of this creepy jail? What's this? Oh, loose brick. Really weird face to make when you're pulling on a brick, but alright. I need some sort of lever. You mean like the spoon that you should have grabbed in the first place? Grab the spoon. <laughs> Fucking kids. <laughs> that could work. Oh, yeah, this ought to do it. <laughs> I'm getting really weird face to make when you're pulling out a brick, but all right. What's in there? Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. The second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. The second you get out.
fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? Okay, now we should get a save. Yep. Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! Alright, that was our save. So we're probably about halfway through chapter seven now. Should be able to finish it off next stream if we push. Which I plan on doing. Top must die. We haven't seen him in the present time yet, so it could be a possibility. Uh, yeah, listen, hold on. How far does it say we are in the game? Okay, so, okay. Oh, fuck. So we got about... Man, we got about two more streams of this, because it's, like I said, about ten hours. We're about five hours into it. Five and a half hours. Yeah, it's a 2K. Uh, yes, it is a 2K product. Even if he is alive in the present. Yeah, we haven't seen yet. Probably no Max could go all ape shit and kill him. So. I don't know. The plot thickens. I guess we find out more. So, tomorrow, uh, taking the night off. And Friday, we'll be back when we're done by daylight. Saturday and Sunday, though, I'm going to spend, I think, finishing this up. Because, yeah, I'm, kinda, I'm, I'm invested now and I want to finish it. So, we will dedicate the weekend to finishing it. And I will see you on Friday, both of you, if you would like, to play some Dead by Daylight. So, yeah. Till then, guys. Um, take it easy, and I'll catch you Friday. All right. Happy gaming. Peace.